All right, guys, welcome back to another video here on the Backlog Gamer channel. We are playing uh, Red Dead Redemption. Oh, God. Uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. We're going to meet Jose up at uh, the Braithwaite's place. Um, Hosea, I mean. And... See what Miss Braithwaite has to say. Uh, we just done a stranger mission, and I actually didn't mean to. I just come across it and hit it accidentally, kind of. Uh, anyways, it's the medicine man one where the guy had his uh, wagon stolen from him. I'm not going to the right place here. Just the grays. I guess the grays. Of course, it's the front of the Braithwaite. I, I don't know. Is this not? Yes, this is where I'm going. There I say. All right, now let's go inside and see what Jose has got going on here. I need to brush my horse. Got dirty, I think he is. Let's uh, brush it right quick. All right. That's my old horsey. Got to take care of my old horsey. Takes care of me. Now, let's go in here and see what... Uh, Is everything all right, in, sir? sir? This way, sir. A gentleman to see you, ma'am. So, your friend, the other liquor vendor. Hello. Hello, ma'am. Arthur, welcome. We are just playing cribbage. Arthur Morgan, Mrs. Catherine Braithwaite. Nice to see you again. Apparently. So this one, he is big and as dumb as he looks? <laughs> well, he's surely big, but his intelligence is a matter of some conjecture. Some say he is as dumb as he looks, but I think, well, he's not quite that dumb. So these are the boys going to Caliga Hall? Yes, we could take care of that for you, but... One hates to be coarse. There is the question of money. <laughs> oh, we've got money, Mr. Matthews. Paper, bonds, metal. <laughs> she ain't gonna pay you with a certified check, you Yankee numbskull. Ain't childbirth just the most beautiful miracle on earth? Seems a lady can birth monkeys, after all. Hop on. We'll fill you in on the way. No, I'm driving. Fine. Let's go. Shiny. Let's get out of here. Let's go. You was quiet in there. Took everything I had. That son of horse. I'll shove that silver spoon down his throat and pull it clean out of his ass. The smug fucker. Okay. So what she got us doing at the Gray's place? She wants us to torture tobacco fields. Said they ain't had rain in weeks round here. What? Yep. Using that back there. Moonshine? Born's faster than kerosene, that stuff. Said it'd be fitting, she did. All I'm thinking is how about I toy fitting my boot up your hook. No, just snotty old bitch. <laughs> Jose really picked the right fella for tea at the manor, didn't he? Ah, oh, he was giving his usual flannel. One of these families got gold stashed somewhere, he reckons. I mean, I'm all for sticking it to rich folks. I hate rich folks. But they're really very so bloody money at the end of all this. Jose knows what he's doing. Does he, though? The master finagler of nothing. Easy, easy. So far, we've destroyed the Braithwaite still. Tried to send the shine back to them. Now we're on this fool's errand, which I'm very much looking forward to, by the way. They were saying old man Gray's double security after that business at the saloon. So, we're just gonna drive on in there, is that it? Don't worry, I got a plan. Wagons go in and out of there all the time with supplies, equipment, payroll. Especially now they're taking on all that extra muscle. We're making a delivery, that's all. Just leave it to me. I can talk a dog off a meat wagon. <laughs> all right then. Yep. 
Hmm. This is going to be interesting, I think. I think this is the one where it's actually going to suck. I think this is the one where you got to spray the field down. Is that right? Of a human being. I'm not going to go that far. <laughs> hmm. We're here. Stay out of sight. I'll do the talking. There was a thing, a, a, a thing, at the saloon. What you talking about? Well, I'm delivering the supplies. You're not the usual driver. Uh, you want a bottle, friend? Here. Uh, uh, have a wee drop. <laughs> I'm new. I, I mean you no harm. <laughs> I, I've come from Donegal, in Ireland. You don't say. Yeah. <laughs> They said you'd understand uh, some kind of incident at the saloon in town. I, I was told to bring this up here. Ask no questions, I'll tell you no lies. Uh, sort of business. Uh, 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 before the officials got there, okay. they said. Okay. Drive this way. I'll show you how to get there. Oh, thank you, friend. Uh, have a drink. Sean. Hmm. Arthur? Uh, Hamish. Good to meet you, Hamish. <laughs> uh, fine bit of country you've got here. Uh, not as fine as Connemara, but fine nonetheless. My people come from Scotland. Is that right? And you and I are nearly brothers. <laughs> <laughs> Just over here. Yeah, I don't want to change to Arthur's point of view. Because it gets so me I sick. Barely keep track of all these deliveries coming in. Yeah, when they said they was looking for more drivers in town, I jumped at the chance. I ain't never been a feller to kick a bit of honest work out of bed. <laughs> so, you folks been having a hard time of it, have you? Yeah, Mr. Gray's got a heap of problems right now with another family around here. A bunch of covetous lowdowns trying to sabotage his livelihood. <sighs> Disgusting. Oh dear, oh dear. I'm sorry to hear that, Hamish. Sounds like you definitely deserve that drink. <laughs> you don't know the half. Just in You're there. about to die. Ah, right you are. <laughs> you can unload it here. In here? Oh, <laughs> the horse is like a, a swift one, <clears throat> do they? <laughs> Excuse me? Um, nothing. It's grand. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, quite a place you yeah. boys have got here. <laughs> Reminds me of one of them big houses there, uh, out in Donegal. Huh. Real fancy places they was, Hamish. Real fancy. Because if some folks got all the money, Let's they can build quite the fanciest places imaginable, eh? <clears throat> okay. I'm gonna hmm. hold up in here till it gets dark. How you getting on? Good. Nearly got these things ready. I'd be drunk on three monkeys in there with that moonshine. <laughs> There's plenty of guards out there. Here's how I feel we should deal with things. You head over to the dry barn. Sure. And you? I'm gonna deal with the fields themselves. We coat everything in moonshine. Then we light things up with these little fellas here. Thankfully, it ain't rained. 
And that old barn over there should go up like a torch. <laughs> How many of these boys you think you need? They should do it. Let's head out the back. Look, once they get wind of us, there'll be no turning back, so move quickly. Of course. I'm rebel stock, boy. I was barb running down with manor houses. We'll burn quietly. Alright, where are we going here? Quiet! There's someone coming on the left. Ha! Oh, hey! Well, I, I thought the wagon already arrived. This one didn't. Strange. So, what you got there? Tools? Payroll? Okay. Drop it by the supply shed at the back of the fields. Sure. See you later. You hear that? Pero. Yeah. Let's get this job done first, okay? We'll take care of this fella. Oh, hurry. Come on. You douse the fields. I'll meet you at the barn. Try to stay out of trouble. This takes an awful long time to pour moonshine. Alright, next. Let's see here. Oh crap. Alright, let's go. Get it, boy, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Alright. Pour some moonshine, man. Let me take a couple swigs. That's good. That should do it. Oh, wait. Good lord. Yeah. Pour it out. Pour it like a champ. There you go. Good job. Now we're into this one. Burn this thing. Just a little extra just to be sure. All right. All right, dude, turn around. Is he coming down this way? You coming down this way, hero? Of course you are. It's gonna be a long night. So, I was gonna say, is there a fence right there I gotta jump over? If I can make it for a second. Nope. Man.
Everybody makes it to four corners. This guy's gonna run right into something right here. Yeah. Now everybody turn around. Go your own. There you go. You're turned around. Now you turn around. And I'll be golden. Or just stand there. Don't move at all. But all these guys. There you go. Here we go. Now we're showing. Wait, dude. I'm supposed to meet him at the barn. I can see that. Oh, different barn. <laughs> I was in completely the wrong barn. Because I don't pay attention. Well, you this a quick ghost as well. Would you look at that? <laughs> hey, well, let's go lay yourselves a fat cigar. You ain't leaving here. Somebody shoot him already. We deal with these fellas. You keep order. You pay for this. Look out! Come on! Where's he at? What are you doing? There's only two of them! Where are these bastards coming from? Mm, in the face. They seem to be taking a well. This is a goddamn mess. They didn't tell you there'd be an army of them? They oh my god. I was gonna take that stuff. Finally. Oh, say you better get us paid real well for this. Bloody right. More men up ahead. There goes out right out of here. The wagon we saw come in earlier. We can nick the horses from that. All right, where is it? This way. Shit. More of the bastards. Stay with me. More guards coming in. Down here, come on! I'm coming. Just... This is what it's all about. Oh, Arthur. Where'd you have fun? I want them dead. Now! Let's go! Get the hell out of here, fast! Do right, follow me! Go! Oh. Oh. Look out! 
Yeah, let's get out of here. Jesus, that turned into a relief party. You call that a party? That plague weight had got a money's worth, Ollie. Let's just get out of here first. I don't know where my horse is at. I think we lost them. Are we dead? Wait a night. Sure. Interesting little fight Dutch has put us into the middle of here. Uh, I hope him and Jose are riding that there's some money at the end of it. Well, what now? Head on back to camp. You coming? Sure. Oh. Hmm. I wonder how much money that got us there. Probably not much at all. Filter burning down. A little bit of moonshine, burn a lot of things. See, now is where the money starts adding up quite a bit, I think. I can't remember which one of these. Let's go do Dutch right quick. I think we got time. Arthur. Arthur. What now? You sweating yet, Dutch? Of course I'm sweating. We're in some disease-ridden, swampy, Dixie-whistling shithole. <laughs> uh, I meant about what Trelawney said about these bounty hunters. I'm not sweating as such, but maybe a little gentle perspiration. Until we know more, ain't too much harm in wasting good liquor on sweating. So? So, I think you should pay Mr. Trelawney a visit and find out exactly what he knows and who he spoke to. Take Charles with you. Oh, the sight of the pair of you would make a statue sing out its secrets. Okay. All right, Charles, me and you. Hi, Charles. I need you for some business in town. Come on. Okay. All right, let's go get on this horse and go get this. Come on. Judge Bye. wants us to have a talk with Trelawney about these bounty hunters who are coming for us. Hoping he can tell us who they are or where they're coming from. Okay. And you're deputies now. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> Soon as we laid eyes on that fool of a sheriff who runs that town, I knew Dutch was gonna play him like a fiddle. On the run from one bunch of lawmen, working for another. Interesting. Hiding in plain sight, Dutch calls it. Hmm. <laughs> so, spirits seem good. In the new camp, I mean. We got some space between us and that mess now. I ain't seen no more Pinkertons for a while. There's these bounty hunters, of course, but Dutch don't seem too worried about it. Can't believe they're still coming after us. We didn't even get away with the money. Yeah, but they don't know that. Of course. Trelawney. I've only met him a couple times, but he's...
Reckon it's that one with fire outside. Let's take a look. Someone got here first. So it seems. By the looks of things, it wasn't a social call. Back the house. I want to get everything I can. You see anything there? This food barely touched. Looks like he left in a hurry. Found anything? Bed's not made, so he must have been here recently. Charles, if you get out of my way. What do you think? There's some blood here. That ain't good. Get out of the way. Let me in here. Big struggle. Pretty recently, I'd Look. say. I guess Tracks. maybe uh, 12 hours ago. But no body? Not yet. Cigarettes. Hey, take him. I'm gonna smoke me a cigar. Think about this, it's like a big, high, and mighty. Oh, I'm done with it. All right, let's go. Yep. Hmm. They went down the path here. How's your tracking these days? Oh. I, I guess. Hmm. Well, lead the way then. Not the kind of place we expect to see Trelawney staying in. No? Normally scams himself into the hotel in town. You know, when me and Javier went down with Trelawney to get Sean after the bar fight, I swear he talked the whole way and never actually said a damn thing. I thought you knew. That's his special talent. They could be 20 miles away by now. We can track them that far if we need to. Depends on how much you want to find him. Yeah. I still ain't sure about that. <clears throat> What's wrong, Arthur? Excuse me. Yeah. Have you seen him? <clears throat> we're, uh, we're looking for our friend. I don't think he's here. Ah, <laughs> uh, you seen a strange sort of fella. Sort of formal. Strange? Sure. Formal? Nah. He uses a cane. Looks a lot like this one. Yeah. All right, you two. Where the hell is he? You both better get out of here. Come in. I'll let him just hit me right in the face. Who do you think you are? He's out. Right to beat you. You go to hell. You better tell me now, you son of a bitch. Okay, okay, for Christ's sake. They took him to a cabin over by the cornfields. Which cornfields? Left. Down the path there by Braithwaite Manor. Yeah, let me. Oh, $26. Wow. $30.
Oh, wow, that was a... All right, anything else here? Nope. All right. We got us a little money money. Come on, let's go. Follow me. I think there's a way around so we don't have to go through the Braithwaite's place. Yes. I've spent enough time there. After you, though. You okay? I'm good. What do you think they want with Trelawney? Could be any one of a hundred things. Just depends if any of them involve us. You think he'll talk? Of course he'll talk. He'd sell his own sister to save a train fare. He don't know how not to talk. He don't know where we're holed up, though. At least I don't think he does. I don't know why Dutch still deals with him. Always disappearing for weeks on end. He's got his uses, and, well, loyalty matters to Dutch. Of course. But is Trelawney loyal? Yeah, kind of. I guess Trelawney ain't exactly disloyal. Just got a big mouth. Don't worry. If he talked, I'll goddamn find out what he said. Nothing's ever straightforward where Trelawney's involved. Learn that much. I mean, how much time have we wasted getting this fool out of trouble? He somehow manages to be both lucky and unlucky at the same time. <laughs> That's one way of looking at it. But he always finds some way to pay us back. Just when we think about cutting him loose, he brings us something big. I guess that's his special talent, keeping fish on the line. Yeah. All right. This is a long ride right here. There's another mission I don't care for too much. Seems like I get a gun or something out of this one. Maybe. That must be it. After that shack, this will be remembered like a good time. Put the man down, gentlemen. Is that the lot of them? I, I think so. Uh, so you're alive. Allegedly. Well, don't worry, they won't be for much longer. Look, go get them, Arthur. I can handle this. What he told them. Let's get after those sons of bitches. They've gone into the cornfield. We need to flush them out. Over there, where the birds are. You wait till I find you. Get 
bastard! Damn it! Barely hit him! We got one more, Charles! Look at the birds! Go that way! Where? My gosh, this is why I hate this one. his gear look around he can't have gone far I just seen his gear just a minute ago dude Give you money. Come on. You should have taken the money. I know. I'm a fool. Oh, shit. Thank you. Twenty nine dollars. Gunshots are coming from that barn. Come on. First, let me take a selfie. Loading, man. Let's go see how badly they beat up the slippery fella. I wonder how much trouble he's brought with him. <laughs> Guess we'll soon find out. Seems like we can't catch a break now, Arthur. Our luck's held this long. We got out of worse scrapes than this one. Mm, so yeah, the heard. rare rolling rock rifle. <laughs> sure. What's government agents and bounty hunters to us? Uh, I hope you're right. Anything up here right quick? Seems like there was something else, maybe. I remember this gun. Um, okay, maybe that was it. I remember getting the rolling rock gun. All right, let's go back and get Trelawney. And then we I will. You wanted to get out of here. I do. How do I get down? 
Oh, over here. <laughs> Come on, Charles, let's get out of here. What are you doing up there, man? You're wasting time. Come on. Yeah, I'll take that hat. I'll take that hat. You're going to wreck. I'm the best it's ever been. Fire on the mountain. Run, boys, run. Get out of the way, Charles. Man with a cool hat coming through here. All right, check my hat out. Mm, something. Mm, mm, mm. I'm going to run all the way up here, Charles. Mr. Trelawney, where are you? Over here, dear boy. Well, he's still here at least. Put your feet up, why don't you? You okay? Never finer. So, who was they? They were bounty hunters. Uh, attached to Cole Stoudemire. Okay. They weren't looking for me, per no. se. What you tell them? Not much. I told them I was an intellectual. Come down here from Oregon. Looking for a job at the university. Of course, they didn't believe me. Seems you stirred up quite a hornet's nest in Blackwater. So I keep here. It might be best if I stay with you gentlemen for a while. Can't go back to that caravan now. All right, Charles. You take Trelawney back to camp. I'll catch up with you. Okay. There always seems to be more. More and more civilization. I want to get back in the open country of the West, or what's left of it, but well, even that ain't the way I remember it. Guys, I appreciate it. Uh, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the content, please consider subscribing to my channel. Leave me some comments on the videos. Let me know what games you would like to see me play. Uh, and with that being said, guys, we will see you all in the next video.